everybody and welcome to August uh, 2021 Food Pantry Haul. Um, if you're here from Haunted Ramblings, hello, how are you? And if you're not a subscriber, why not? It's free. Um, and welcome to all my new subscribers. Um, I have so many over the last um, month. I I am on disability. I do not receive food stamps so I am very blessed by a um, food pantry that is very very generous and our food pantry is supported by partly by its own um, thrift store and it is a large thrift store so um, it also relies on donations um, and donations from stores and that kind of thing so some months it is really large and some months it's not um, this is one of those months where it's not as big but um, I'm looking at quite a bit of really nice stuff and I don't just toss away anything I don't use at the end of the month it gets put in my food pantry in my closet as a prep um, this is so if things happen and I can't get out or I become ill or if I have another stroke like I did in January where I can't go um, and just readily go get out and go, go go grocery shopping or something like that, I have that. I have that to rely on. Or if things happen and stores shut down or we can't get out and do things, I have that. And everybody should have something to fall back on. And one of these days, maybe in the next couple weeks, I will show you how my um, prepping closet has become in that just because you're on disability or um, you get stuff from food pantries or that kind of thing um, even if it's you put up um, out of a month two or three meals worth of food two or three days worth of food that adds up over a year and I really haven't purchased anything to put in my prepping closet I have just been building it up of stuff that I have not used during the month. So, with that being said, I want to welcome all of my new subscribers that are watching and all of the new people that are just popping in for the first time. If you're seeing bits of this, because I'm going to make a condensed version for Rambling Brambles Vlogs, so that's my vlog channel, welcome there also. Um, let's get into this. I'm going to do like I did last month. I am just going to um, go over everything here. Yes, I'm sitting on my kitchen floor. This is easiest for me, and my subscribers love to see me just unbox everything. So um, when he handed me the breads, he said, check your breads because there could be some bad. So I already checked this one, and like he said, we do have um, a bad loaf. So I'm going to set this aside and check the whole thing. Um, I over thoroughly so I'm setting that one aside and this one is perfectly fine if I go camping this will probably go with me it depends on the heat now it says it's going to be extremely hot I also got a box of cornflakes and a box of Rice Krispies I can eat the Rice Krispies cornflakes I have to go sparingly but there's some recipes I want to do with the cornflakes so um, I may not be passing that box along to anybody so all of you that don't know things that I don't use or can't eat because of my digestive problems I do um, share with other people in my senior living community um, I also got egg noodles I love getting these and let's go to they had a bunch of boxes of a freebie foods that you can take whatever you want of and there was ungodly amounts of boxes and more to bring out he said take as much as you want well I didn't take all that much um, I got a carrot cake I've always wanted to try this it is I'm never gonna pronounce that right but I've always wanted to try it so I got one of those these have been kept frozen um, he's upside down, but I got a uh, cheesecake with, uh, I believe it's cherry, strawberry. Oh, that's even better. 
And then I got two plain cheesecakes. These are out of the um, free for the taking boxes. I'm going to shift gears here a little bit on you halfway through. I have, um, in the summer, we get these bags that they prepare for children and for seniors, disabled, um, people who go to the food pantry also get them. Um, you get a variety of snacks. There's four snack bags. Four of the juice boxes. These are delicious. And then I also got a little can of pork and beans and some SkettiOs. And it's like one meal. Plus I got some hand sanitizing wipes and some hand sanitizer. I love this bottle. That is awesome. So that is what gives out every day to ch school children. I also got four one half gallon milks that are good until the 7th. Um, I'm going to make some pudding up. I also got a brick of cheese. I believe it's a two pound. I don't remember. Uh, yes, two pound brick of American cheese. I also got a jug of orange juice and my one dozen of eggs. Those are our normal things. Let's go through this bag and see what's in it. I got a beef stew in a pouch. It's getting that time of the year. I'm getting raisins and shelled walnuts. Great for baking. Some potato flakes. I can replenish my beans. These are pinto and some yellow split peas. Oh my gosh, these are good. I love those split peas. This bag has, ooh, frozen stuff, I can feel it. We have a yummy bag of blueberries. These are great to have. I love the blueberries. A pound of butter. Ooh, yummy. This is sliced cooked ham. I am glad this is not a huge big one like I used to get because it was way too much when it thawed. So I'm glad to see it's just a little package, not a huge one. And now we have some, ooh, did that really say bison? Oh my gosh, guys. I have always wanted to try this, but this stuff is like extremely expensive. This is ground bison. Okay, I'm, I'm really excited for that. And then we have our ground beef. And let's go to this little box. This is our snack box. We usually get something that's snack oriented, which is cool. We have some Fruity Pebble crisps. They look cool. Not funny. I like the colors of them. I will have to try those. There's three bags of those. We have some cheesy tuna. That's going to be good. We got some more corn flakes. So I might donate a bag to other uh, people that live here some original topped with sea salt I can't eat these I'm going to get these I'm allergic to sea salt for those of you that are new to my channel so we're gonna get those right out of my sight I don't want to be sick um, and then we have a white cake that is going to be awesome I'm going to start a box to put stuff in we have Beef burgers. Are you kidding me? 100% pure beef burgers. I'm excited. That's awesome. I'm going to be taking those camping with me. And then we have, um, these are the uh, pork patties with soy protein product. I get these almost every month. Then we have some Johnsonville Italian sausage hot. I love these things. I absolutely love these things. They don't love me, but I love these things. If I eat that, it's my own fault. These are sockeye salmon filet portions. Now, I didn't keep 
or did I keep last month's? I think I gave last month's away, but I, you know what? I'm going to try this month's. And then I have a ground beef. This is from Walmart. Um, <clears throat> and it is the, the, the cheaper stuff. I have a ground turkey. I have an Uncrustables. Um, somebody seen them in my refrigerator and wanted them. So I let them have them. I didn't get to try it. I got another ground beef. I got some jumbo franks, and then I got a tube of ground beef. So I got quite a bit of um, meat this month. I'm going to pause you. Okay, I also got my um, usual uh, turkey or turkey chicken, my young chicken. And then I got the, it was frozen to the um, thing, it's an egg. Um, frozen egg product. I don't think it's a real egg when they have to say that it's egg product. I got in my toiletry bag, I've got paper towels. I'm going to toss them over there to go to the bathroom. Some sanitizing wipes. You don't want to put these on your backside, people. Or your coochie. That could hurt. This is Natural insect repellent. Does it have DEET? No. I should not have bought my insect repellent because now I have another one. I am allergic to DEET, guys. We have some Aveeno, and then we have some of the shampoo and conditioner, and then we have some of the Listerine Ready Tabs. Oh my goodness, I almost bought some of these. That is cool to get. So there's my toiletries. I'm going to set them over there. This one has, oh, are you kidding me? I thought this was going to be spam and I was excited, but I'm even more excited because it's chunk chicken with broth and ground chicken added. Cool. I got a um, lemon cake with that nut box. And then I got some cupcakes. Some cookies, some Southgate chili with beans, peanut butter. What is this? What is this? Kubis, um, hazelnut, instant coffee cubes. Really? It looks like this, guys. I might take these camping with me. This would be better to take camping than my coffee pot. Huh. I'm going to make sure they stay out. And then I got some deli style mustard with, oh, with horseradish. That, it makes me happy. Um, we have some chicken with rice soup. Some Pillsbury biscuit mix. Just add milk. And then we have, oh my gosh, Chef Bardi Pizza Maker. It has everything. Um, add your own mozzarella cheese and toppings. It doesn't have everything. Um, hold on. Okay, it's crust mix and pizza sauce with pepperoni. It makes two 12-ounce pizzas. It doesn't actually have the pepperoni or the cheese. It is just the sauce and the uh, crust mix. And then we have two Nutri Valley Trail Mix Fruit and Nut Bars. Over in this one, we have some Hawaiian Punch, some Egg Mix, some Beef Jerky Teriyaki. I'm going to set that over there. I might want to take that with me. We got some Yummy Tomatoes. I'm going to set them there. This is my vegetable box. We have some celery hearts. We've got one, two oranges, two cups of fruit, peach chunks, and cherry mixed fruit. And then we have one of them's kind of cut up because of being in and out of boxes. I believe they are. They actually don't say what they are. I think they're nectarines. I get confused. 
then we have some avocados and then we have some yummy plums there's three of those and then we have oh if i can get a hold of them four potatoes and then we have some super blend brussels sprouts cabbage kohlrabi kohlrabi broccoli carrots and kale and then we have a container of um, pineapple. And that is for that box. I'm gonna put these all back in there. And the very last box, I can't believe I'm getting through this this quickly. I'm getting better at it, guys. Um, we have elbow macaroni, always great to have. I keep everything in Tupperware, so um, I have a big Tupperware container. I keep all my macaroni in. And then we have some dry roasted almonds. I'm looking on different ways to use these, so um, I get a lot of nuts. Almonds, hazelnuts, walnuts, I get a lot of them. And I can't eat them because they don't digest. So that is not going to happen. So I'm looking for things to make that I could possibly sell. Then we got some whole dates. That's pretty cool. Macaroni and cheese. An enormous can of chunk light tuna. A can of beef. A can of applesauce. A can of potatoes. A can of mixed fruit, a can of black beans, a can of uh, pasta sauce, a can of cream and mushroom soup. I'm thinking making me a pot of a container. What do you call it? Like tuna noodle casserole, guys. <laughs> um, and a can of pears. Okay, everybody, that was it. Quick, easy. Um, that's why I was pausing things. Normally, I don't go through the whole pausing and I make cuts and then my editing takes me forever. But what an awesome little haul. Um, I got so much stuff. This ground bison, guys. Um, I'm looking forward to trying that. And um, the sockeye salmon portions. I'm looking forward to that also. Um, a lot of really good stuff. Um, I have a trash bag. I always leave this hanging out. Does anybody ever do that? Anybody else do that? So all they have to do is just pull out a bag and it comes out of the drawer. Um, otherwise I'm fighting to get it off the roll. So that's what that is hanging out of my drawer. <laughs> all right, guys, thank you so much for watching and hanging out with me. Um, I appreciate each and every one of you, and I'm always blessed when I get my food pantry, and knowing what I get at the beginning of the month helps me be able to finish doing my grocery shopping for the rest of the month. And everybody, have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye, guys.